Hey, what's going on, my fellow reefers? Do a video here. This one's going to be about LED lights. Is, uh, I'm wanting to get some new lights for the tank. Okay, so I really want your guys' input on this. So in the comments, I want you to tell me what lights you think I should get. So I'm going to go through some options. I'm going to show you what I've currently got now. As you can see, I really like this slim design. You can't even tell it's on the tank if you step back. See, you don't even know there's a light up there, which I really, really like. Now, I did only pay like 110, 120 bucks for this. And this is the, uh, what is this? The current Orbit Marine LED Pro, I think. Yeah. And it's got, you know, all your basics on it. Let me get this thing to focus again. You see, it's got all your basics. It's got your, uh, well, you know, you can program it and all that. Ramp up, ramp down. It's got the storm, the clouds, the lightning, the moonlight. Which is another reason I bought it. Because it was pretty cheap and it had pretty much everything I wanted in a light at the time. But now that I got corals, I'm not so sure, you know, how well they'll do. And it does put off a little bit of shimmer. Not a lot, but a little bit. Okay. And this here is uh what we're working with on the lights as you can read all that i'm pretty sure you can read uh that's the uh color spectrum but uh anyways i really do like these lights like i've said i haven't had any problems with them but you know like i said now i've got coral so i kind of want to want the coral to be grow better i guess you could say i don't know now one thing you're gonna have to keep in mind i do have this piece of shit thing in the middle here so I can't just clip a light in the middle like I was wanting to do unless I can cut this out do you do any of you guys know if I can cut this brace out because if I can cut it out I'll just cut it out and get some radions but if not uh yeah so you do have to keep that in mind I do have this brace so I can't put just like one light in the middle um but uh anyways we'll let's go through some I'm going to use Bulk Reef Supplies website here. It's just, it's easier to do it. Okay, well first we're going to go to the Ecotex. Now, right now, I thought about maybe going with uh, two of these, uh, uh, what are they, XR15 G4 Pros. I thought about maybe going with two of those, but I really don't want two lights hanging on the tank. I, I just don't. Uh, now these uh, G4 Pros, I can actually get these right now. The uh, 30, 30 Pros, I can get them for 650 bucks shipped to my house right now. As you see right there, they're 800 bucks, but I can get them for 650 all day long. Uh, like I said, though, I got that middle brace, so I don't, I don't think that'll work because I don't, definitely don't want to put two of those on there. It'll look like shit. My tank is a three foot tank. So let's jump into Giesman. Okay, now the Giesman here. Where are we at? This is another one I was really looking at. The Verve Plus LED with Bluetooth. That's a really nice light, but I think it might be too small for the tank. And once again, hanging options I'm not so sure about. Because I don't want to hang it from the ceiling, it's got to be attached to the tank will not hang from the ceiling but you know I mean if you guys want to check these lights out for yourself you can obviously just go to the BRS website or however you want to do it but I'm just kind of giving you a rundown of the options of the lights I'm looking at and remember I do want your input on this okay let me click this damn magnifying glass off Okay, let's jump into Kessels. Now, this is the one I really want to buy. Okay. This one right here, the AP700. See, it's it's not cheap. I can probably get it for 700 maybe. But it, it'll work on my tank. And they do have mounts. There's two mounts. There'll be one that goes on this side and one that goes on this side that will come off the tank. Which would work. The only problem with this one is... is uh, there's not too many reviews about it, and the ones that are are pretty negative. You know, I've looked at YouTube, and a lot of them, you know, they 
I'm sure they're probably good now because they've been out for, I don't know, a few months anyways. About six probably. But these are the ones I'm really wanting to buy. I really like these Kessels. Basically because um, Kessels, you know, pretty known for their shimmer and these things are massive shimmer. And uh, you can just directly connect straight to the light and change all your modes and it's, you know, it's got all that good stuff. That's really the one I want to buy. But like I said, the reviews aren't very good on it. But uh, I think all the bugs are probably worked out of it by now, I'm assuming. Now I'm also talking, you know, it'll probably be, damn it. It'll probably be another two months or so before I, I buy a light. But I just kind of want to give you guys an idea. Let's go back to Kessel again. There's also these here. Focus. Um, the wide angles or the narrow. The A360s. But two of those would be too much. Because once again, I got that metal brace in my tank, so I can't just put one of these. So I thought maybe doing the, uh, the one, two 160s. But, you know, I'm not sure. But, like I said, that is the one I really do want. It's just the reviews are pretty bad on it. But I think they've got all the bugs worked out. Uh, let's go to Max Spec. Max Spec. Uh, they have... It would probably be the 180 watt. 15K Razor that I was thinking about getting as well. But, you know, I don't know. I don't know anything about this company so if any of you guys have these lights out there I mean yeah you could definitely tell me how well they are if you like them or whatever let's jump into Zet light for a minute uh, be this one here or that one there this that one I think yeah that one is bigger that's another option it's apex ready. I think you just basically plug it into your apex and you're good to go with that. Uh, so, yeah. Like I said, the Radeons I can get extremely cheap. 650 all day long. Shipped to my house. It's just... You know, I got that damn metal brace in the tank. And the Giesman I really like too. But it's also... Uh, I don't know how big it is you know what I mean and mounting options I'm not too sure on mounting options I know you can, you can hang all these from the ceiling but I don't want to hang them from the ceiling that's for the hybrid the Aurora that Verve Plus looks pretty sick so I'm thinking between the Verve and the Kessel AP 700 which is I don't know, man. I really like it, but like I said, the reviews are kind of shitty on it. But it still gives you that great shimmer, and it's Kessel, you know. I've heard nothing but absolutely good things about Kessel lights. They produce probably the best growth for your coral. Now, I'm not running any SPS or anything. I just got, like, softies and a couple Fabias and LPS. But for the future. But, you know, you're thinking, what's that say, 895? You figure I can probably get it for seven. Figure 700 plus mounting, which I don't even think they have them on here, the mounting. And you can also get diffusers for those too. Uh, yeah, there it is right there. I think that's it. But one of those is $65, so you, yeah, I'd have to get two of those. So yeah. If you guys would please let me know in the comments uh, what you think. What lights would you go with? What should I get? I mean, like I said, it's going to be a couple months. Basically because, well, I mean, it's a, we're talking, you know, roughly a grand here on fucking lights. So when I only spent, you know, 120 or so on this. And these have the, um, I don't know if I went over this or not. Somewhere it shows the, oh, that's a fell. Where the hell did I see that? Somewhere up there it is. It's either 8,000K and 12,000K whites. All it is is pretty 
Yeah, I'm back. The uh, camera shut off. Anyways, like I was saying, all there is is a white and a blue, basically. I mean, you can kind of mess with it a little bit and you can get it to look purple. But, you know, all those other lights, they got reds and greens and, you know, all that other shit going on with them. And I just really think it'd make the corals pop. I mean, they already pop, but, you know, with better light, I mean, I really think they would just stand out. And like right now, it's kind of got a blue tint to it on the camera, but it's not blue at all in person. I mean, it's white. So, yeah, uh, if you guys would, let me know about the lights, what you would go with, what you think I should go with. Uh, I appreciate all the feedback. Uh, you can always uh, subscribe if you want. Leave a like if you did. Remember, happiness is a reef tank. We'll see you on the next one, fellas. Peace.